Hello water signs, welcome back to Truth Be Told Transformations. We are going to do your love reading from now till four months or four months, four weeks out. Some of you um, are about to embark a journey between now and four months out. You're going to be in a different spot in a relationship than you are now. Do you feel the energy of a new relationship for some of you? Okay. Unexpected. I just heard. I did get some downloads, but I'll do those in another video. Um, this is a general perspective. There was an ash that fell down. My ears ringing really well. Looks like someone here is getting upgrades. Your audience is coming in, being turned on. That's what I'm hearing. So I'm going to do this um, same way I did the air sign reading. Okay. I call upon our angels, your directions. North, south, east, west, above, and below. We are protected in all six corners as well as below. I sent my readings to be truthful, inspiring, motivating, and clear. New love came out as I was shuffling, so I'm going to leave out. We're going to say the Lord's Prayer. I'm going to say the Lord's Prayer that was translated from Aramaic to English. It was found on the scroll in 1892. All cosmic birth ray radiance and vibration soften the ground of our being and carve out within us a space where your presence can abide, fill us with your creativity so that we may be empowered to bear the fruit of your mission. Let each of our actions bear fruit in accordance to our desire and tell us with the wisdom to produce and share what each being needs to grow and flourish. Untie the tangled threads of destiny that binds us as we release others from the entanglement of past mistakes. Do not let us be seduced by that which will divert us from our true purpose. But will illuminate the opportunities of the present moment, for you are the ground and fruitful vision, the birth, the power, and fulfillment, as all is gathered and made whole once again, and so it is. Sunflowers may be significant, the phoenix, the unicorn, and the stone, Chalcedony, Chalcedony, C-H-A-L-C-E-D-O-N-Y, any color. Okay new love i do feel there um this new love will come in quicker if you surrender i heard surrender to the divine and some need cord energy work cord pulling at the root wedding they're worth waiting for so for someone here that is a cancer pisces or scorpio this will result in a marriage you're gonna meet them between now and four months your healing family issues, your love life benefits as you forgive your parents, express your love, go ahead and make the romantic gestures so you may make the first move towards this person. Um, I feel like you're go supposed to go ahead and make the first move in healing your family issues as well. You're breaking generational curses while doing this. What else spirit? Finances and career. Financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. Maybe you feel like you're not where you're supposed to be or want to be. Um, and you, uh, but the person coming in will help you. They won't mind that. I do feel like they will be, one of, for someone here, they will have more money than you, but they're, you're going to give and take equally and work as a team. I see attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying the moment fully so get out and have fun enjoy life be in the present not in the past and not in the future stay optimistic um about your love life positive thinking and faith will bring you romance call it in some of you are manifesting in for this praying for this stop and smell the roses somebody here is going to reconcile cancer pisces scorpio water energy with someone from the past someone from your past is returning to your life but I feel there are some of you here that are done with the past and you're ready for this future, right? Yeah, so you're saying release your ex. Don't, look, that's what's keeping you from this new love is because some of you are, um, think you're done with this person. They're going to come back in and you might be confused. Spirit is encouraging you to, to move forward, especially if you've been in a, you know, they were, 
Now you had time to heal. Very soon this person's coming back and they're going to deceive you. They are wearing a mask. They're going to say they've changed. They miss you. Grim. This is a warning. Don't, okay? Don't say I didn't tell you. Remember to only take what resonates, leave what doesn't, okay? And this could be the one. This new love could be the one. And you would miss this for going back to the past. So, you know, I encourage you to get a private reading for someone that you trust or to do one yourself. True love will have heart-to-heart -heart conversations. This is a romance of a lifetime. You've already met the roommate partners. I feel like there's past life with this person. I'm meeting very much renaissance times. I'm also seeing a past life in Asia, an Asian culture for someone here. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other. You're gonna have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with someone. They're gonna say, I'm your true love. I'm the one, you're the one for me, but this is unrequited love, okay? past life relationship this happened in the past and they stopped you from finding the love of your life it's breaking um, a contract okay children may be a factor in your love life all right you can have children with that person coming back so you love may already have children for some of you we're gonna break this down with the tarot I'm just gonna break down each card feeling the energy to see which one ten of cups on the bottom I did shuffle these beforehand and that's new love for the first this could be the this is the energy of the new love can lead to marriage ten of cups ultimate happiness happy life happy life energy happy husband, you know, happy husband happy life. i just feel it's going to be for reciprocation but you have to release the ties to the past i just heard the past has nothing good to say for someone here that's not for all of you only take what resonates okay it's very important i'm just don't shoot the messenger, okay? Clarify new love for water signs. This new love, you're going to build a solid foundation with them. It'll be equal give, equal take. This is marriage. This is soulmate energy, yin, yang. Two birds of any kind could be significant, especially doves. I saw two blue birds, male and female, male and female of any bird. D divine, this new person's being brought into your life by the divine because you don't deserve what happened to you in the past and spirit really wants you to be open to receive and ready to move on. Purple butterflies are significant. If you see any of the things I mentioned in this reading in your reality, the numbers or anything like that, that is um, confirmation of this reading for you, okay? Leo, enter to the strength card. Be strong. It's time, you know, spirit saying be strong. Yeah, the past, you and this people in the past that didn't work out with any of them for a reason because you were going through lessons learning the mission some of you went back to someone time and time again hoping that they would change but they didn't but it ended so you could go within and heal and learn to love yourself so things can be transformed and this new love energy true love could be brought into your awareness what is this healing family issues some of you are spending time and not like out in public kind of spending time alone going within learning about yourself learning to love yourself you found the answers within you found the light the lantern right you found your way ravens blackbirds and crows could be significant scorpio energy here is the emperor just came out yeah look this new love is your emperor he exhibits all four kings in the deck. Okay, healing these family issues is going to help this emperor come in or embrace to your life um, with the stability with uh, when it comes to love. Express your love. This person will not be afraid to express their love. Neither will you. It'll feel like it happened to you know so fast. Knight of Cups. They're coming in. Yeah, somebody here might go through a breakup um, with a past person or someone that is not for their highest good. This is happening to shake things up. It's a surprise. This person's going to come in as a surprise when you least expect it. Um, but there, I do get that there is going to be um, a breakup between a couple. They, um, a breakup, fight, divorce, split up is what I'm getting. Um, don't necessarily have to be married. It's going to be shocking. You're going to find out some truth. And this is happening so your emperor can come in. So you can know the truth. Like spirit's been showing you you should leave this person but you you know want to try to stay married and or try to stay together and you don't 
like you're it's a fear about moving on because you're worried you won't have enough money but spirit will pro help you provide for you everything that you need one more clarify tower yeah spirit saying temper your energy when this happens try to see it from a higher perspective blue butterflies purple butterflies white butterflies are very significant at this time Sagittarian energy, finances and career. Two of Wands. It's, you know, your choice, Spirit says. You could be a mother and worried about finances. But I feel like, yeah, the devil's wanting to scare you that you won't make enough money to keep you in your shadow. Stand your ground. You will be celebrating. Okay, you are protected from this shadow energy, from harm, from the projections. The choice is up to you. It doesn't make you a bad mom or a bad parent for leaving someone who isn't, doesn't give what you give, continuously puts you down, stresses you out, okay? You intuitively know this. You are a very caring, beautiful person. I'm so sorry that you're going through this. I see Capricorn energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I see your energy. This has been a long time coming. This person acts very mature. And I don't feel like they necessarily, for someone here, they don't help with the bills. Like, you flip the bill, okay? Attraction is here. Clarify this, please. I'm seeing a lot of pain with the Three of Swords continuously stabbing you in the, in the back, in the heart. Maybe using God and saying, well, you know, using religion against you or twisting it to fit their own narrative. Okay? Spirit saying, um, you have a different take on spirituality, religion, and I do feel you're meant to teach, you're meant to your leader. Go back to school. I see you going back to school for someone here. It's going to help you go into your empress mode. All right, don't miss the blessing. Spirit saying, stay optimistic about your love life. The lovers, the page of cups. You're getting an offer, but it's an immature offer. Okay, it's full of lies, pain, and betrayal from this lover from your past okay or someone all right reconciliation is here let's see what's this reconciliation you have an ace of coins spirit saying they're bringing in new that you could there's possibly going to be an unexpected somebody could have a pre an unexpected pregnancy okay um something is hidden could be a pregnancy for some of you someone's hiding and they got someone else pregnant you're going to find out about this but spirit's bringing you a blessing Their, your finances will be met if you do decide to move on from this you just need to have faith and manifest release your ex yeah they're very childish okay they like to very much a cheating energy um they like to poke around poke, poke around and everything or get poked in a lot okay Spirit saying, eight cups, walk away. This is not the one. This new energy coming in could be the one. I do see a reconciliation for someone here, but this is not someone who's abused you in any way. This is not someone who's cheated on you time and time again, okay? This is just like a fight, break up, you know, because of stress in life, all right? But this new person coming in is going to give and take equally. It's going to balance the scales. They could be the one. What's this true love here? Yeah, they're not going to hide anything from you with true love. This is a romance of a lifetime, Pisces energy. You do have many options, so speak from your heart. Keep your eyes open. Listen to your intuition. This is going to happen quicker other than later. Unrequited love. Yeah, I feel like this person with the unrequited love, something about finances, they could lose their job or something is going to happen. I just see a loss of money. They may be using you for money. Um like especially if you break away from them some of you may not want to leave because maybe they won't have a place to stay they won't have to be able to be taken care of and sometimes you know that's the way things happen so that they have to heal they have to um follow the truth i do see a wish fulfillment here okay um walking away is going to provide a wish fulfillment for somebody others of you you know you're done with the past and your ships are coming in you're manifesting new love okay let's get some oracle cards and the hidden truth out here again this is for water signs cancer pisces scorpio 
whatever is in the darker tones are light. There are many, you can see a lot of divorces, a lot of people breaking up, a lot of truth being revealed. You've seen it in the media, but you're also about to see it in your life if you haven't already. Yeah, this ex-lover is going to bump into you. They've been watching you, and they're going to try to say it was a faded moon. This is destiny. It's meant to be. This is just to get in your energy to try to, because they're, I do feel they've got, they're in some shadow energy, okay? Yeah, somebody does, they prefer pretend they, they're somewhere else and they have a secret crush on you. I do feel someone does have a secret crush on you, but Spirit's saying they're fueled with addictions. They want to come in and use money. Um, read between the lines, okay? Yeah, they're wearing a mask, pretending to be a friend or coming through a friend of yours that you thought you could trust or an acquaintance. They just want to hook up. They're going to say, what, we have unfinished business. I love you. I'm the one for you. You're my soulmate. They're a player, okay? And this is going to be unexpected. You know they're a player, but you do love them. Text, just, they're going to send you a message. Again, a phone call, direct message, communicate to you, bump it, you know, try to, to reconcile. But they, like I said, some of you, it's going to be a hidden account, is what I'm feeling. Yes, it's going to be unexpected. Someone here will get back with somebody and they're gonna, they may regret it, okay? There's a storm warning with this relationship, spirit speaking, okay? They've been watching your social media, they've been stalking you. Like I said, faded meeting is here. Someone wants to stop a faded meeting between you and your true counterpart. Be careful, this is, my, this is gonna end a heartbreak for somebody. Spirit's encouraging you to keep pushing through the change. It's time for you to regenerate, to go through your metamorphosis. You're growing and changing and healing. This person, be brave, liquid courage, brave, it's time for you to be brave, okay? You have a soulmate coming in, you're going to have a magnetic attraction with, it's going to feel like it happened so fast, it was there divinely planted in your path, okay? This person from the past may have ghosted you, there is a third party and there is someone, someone, there is a hidden pregnancy, okay? Like, is going to lead to somebody's breakup and allow you to date others. This person doesn't want you to date because this is a toxic relationship. You intuitively know this. You're going to regret it if you do it. But you're so stressed out and so anxious. Spirits encouraging you to travel to meet new people. Get out and about. Socialize. Okay? You can meet this new person at a, a social gathering, a party, a wedding. Uh, graduation, out and about with your friends, okay? Divine timing is at play here. They are, like I said, divinely planted in your path. The past the past person could have some legal matters, okay? It could be divorce. You are going to get your justice. Your justice is to be happy with this person who's going to make you their all, and you're going to be like the it couple together, okay? And it will result in marriage. Beautiful. This is the freaking truth. I know there's a mystery here. You're gonna, you're gonna mysteriously bump into each other, kind of like serendipity. I've been feeling lately. You you have to lean into fear, okay? If you go back to the past, there will be a divine intervention because you're gonna repeat this same old cycle. If you want to repeat it, go ahead. That was for someone I don't know who. You know, like I said, don't shoot the messenger. All right, let's get the hidden truth from this past person. I want you back. But I can't be with you. And only you, I heard. Hidden truth, please, from this ex-partner. I trusted you. I watch your social media. I still feel the pain. I feel like that's your energy. I daydream about a life with you. Flew in the reverse. These are all upright, by the way. I would do it again, meaning hurt you, cheat on you if they did anything like that. I want you so badly. They still haven't learned their lesson, though says I'm recovering. I feel like they're, somebody is lying about being in recovery. That's not for all of you. You inspire me. I don't want to let you go. I am patiently waiting. I wonder how you feel. Sorry, the animal's snoring. Um, I want to make amends. I feel so drawn to you. So... I feel like this new person is going to, you're going to feel drawn to each other. Um, they wonder if you're having trouble, like, with intimacy. 
They do want to know if they still have a chance. They want to make amends, though. I feel like they need money. Like, I can't help what I feel. Yeah, they hide their true feelings and true motives. I just heard, thank you, spirit. That's from somebody, okay? Your intellect arouses me. I feel like you really trusted this person. And you even forgave them. And they just continuously hurt you. I'm so sorry. I've been there. And you deserve so much more. Alright, water signs. Let's get a message from this future person. I am grateful for the spiritual lesson. Spirit wants you to you know it's not happening to you, it's happening for you. They are so attracted to you. I do feel you meet in the dream state in the Okay. I'm becoming a better person. I feel like you will make each other better people. It's time for me to heal. They are healing. I wish I could share my good news with you. I remember every detail of the day. And this is also for the reconciliation person that I said is a good reconciliation. Like, they didn't. You left on good terms, okay? I couldn't let you get close to me, someone's saying. I will, uh, I will wait for a sign from you. I left you before you could leave me. So many things remind me of you. I lost myself for a little while. You're the best thing in my life. I can't stop thinking about you. I wish I could take back my words. I want to tell you how I feel. Alright, only take what resonates, remember. So I do feel the new person, you know, don't realize you guys meet on the 5D. I feel like they are growing and you're going to help. You're going to like spring their spiritual ascension. They may not even be spiritual until after you guys get together. Let's get an affirmation card just because I'm curious. Can I have an affirmation card, please, that they can use for love and for this reading spirit? Uh, the more I tune my energy with appreciation, the more the universe will deliver. So be appreciative even for the lessons, right? And for your blessings of love, bless, uh, of all abundance and prosperity. It comes in many forms. When I'm grateful for what I have, I can feel good along the way along the way to what I desire. I let an inner sense of quiet multiply each day as I strengthen my faith in the love of the universe. I'm sorry, I'm trying to speak over the animal in there. Uh, confirmation let's get you guys some soulmate twin flame messages okay this is for water signs cancer pisces scorpio guidance please cancer pisces scorpio take what resonates leave what doesn't if you would like a love reading for just your sign comment your sign below water sign and i will put out one for just that sign and your energy will be in that reading because it will be ready thank you guys for the likes comments and everything i really appreciate you have transform healing and embrace i'll read them in just a minute my beloved and forgiveness stop focusing forgiveness stop focusing your energy on past events Life is too precious to waste. You create your reality by what you think, dream, and imagine. My beloved, this is from this new person for somebody. Though we may be physically apart, spiritually we're always united for love, transcend space and time. Nothing is missing. Embrace through each other. You find the missing pieces. Healing. This is with this new person. Imagine yourself and your beloved being surrounded by light. Feel your relationship being healed this very moment. That is for the one I said that, you know, you weren't, they were not like clowning on you. You didn't cheat on me weren't cheating on each other but you know what i mean or they didn't cheat on you or tear you down okay transformation your relationship with another is about to deepen love conquers and transforms all things that is for somebody who may be having some relationship love issues time you're trying too hard give it time message please for this collective water sign collective friendship nurture the bonds of friendship within your relationship and your love life will dramatically improve a message for you. I'm thinking of you this very moment. Your love fills me with light. I love you. And don't make decisions based on guilt or what you think you should do. It's only being true to yourself that you can be true to others. Okay? And I feel like you want, you're you going through a period of like major growth. You may be changing your the way you dress, your hair color. Um, changing up, you're changing up things, maybe even getting a new car, new home, new attitude for some of you. Message from the angels, please. Take action. No more procrastinating because you are well planned, well prepared, and therefore ready to make a move. So 
so you're ready to make the move. You can take action on this. Get out and put yourself out there. Anticipate. There should be a few challenges or obstacles awaiting for you on the way to success. Be anticipating these ones, you will absolutely soften the problems and get more decisive solutions. So somebody needs to anticipate the things may not go well um, with, uh, I feel like with somebody, there could be an argument. I did tell you I felt a break for divorce, okay? 2222, in every circumstance of life, this huge change is going to bring your inner peace and harmony. All conflicts are coming to an end, To give so give way to compassion and empathy. It's okay to have compassion and empathy for someone and still not want them in your energy or want to take them back. Stay calm. Somebody's going to push your buttons or your nerves, okay? Be cool. Be calm. You got to figure out your inner strength and wisdom only when your mind is placed placid. You are going to figure out your inner strength and wisdom when your mind is placid. Things are coming. Things are, wait. Lights are coming and the light is going to shine through the darkness. These cards have misprints on them, sorry. Improve your health. Physical health is essential to remain. Sorry, guys. Physical health is essential to remain a functional body. Detoxify your mind with healthier food to do some breathing exercises and meditate more. Sorry. I'm going to, I'm wrapping this reading up. I'm going to get you your Archangel Michael card. Okay. See what sign you could be dealing with as well. Which will be confirmation for some of you. Archangel Michael, what guidance do you have for this relationship leading to my water signs? We have three different stories here. Focus upon divine and perfect health. Explore your options. Told ya. You're on the right path. What else, Archangel Michael? Go forward fearlessly. Forgive yourself. You've done nothing wrong. Use your imagination. You'll see the answer. It's time to leave this unhealthy situation. Leave the past in the past. Thank you. That's confirmation for somebody. Okay. And I do feel it's going to happen. Whether that you... Leave it along or divine intervenes for somebody, okay? Please don't shoot the messenger. <laughs> Some people get mad at me because I have to tell you guys the truth. You know, I can't, I'm not, I'm here to be, you know, I tell people all the time, if you don't want a truth for later, I'm not the one to come to. I try to tell you, you know, in an empathetic and loving and caring way, because I do care, right? But I have to speak what spirit tells me. If I didn't, then I would not be a good reader, you know? What signs could these water signs be dealing with? Virgo. Pisces, dealing with another. With Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. You're a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, dealing with a Pisces or a Virgo. And another water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, one more spirit. Fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. That's in their big three, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Okay? Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus is where those are at. I need to leave these out. Sorry. If you guys hear the snoring in the background, I apologize. get you a healing mantra and get you a soul truth message healing mantra please for my water signs the voice of the heart i silence the fear in me i discover the voice of my heart the fruit of those words guides me i trust the song of my soul my intuition leads me on the right path so you are on the right path keep moving forward okay now is not the time to back down let's get your soul truth message and i'll let you guys go i probably won't be back on today um maybe we are going to do Earth Signs next for the love readings. Be sure to check out my free my post I posted in the community board about the free reading for my subscribers. Okay, it's my way to get back. It's a full free reading with me. 
And I'm also going to give a second winner, which, which is either a Reiki healing of your choice, you know, a Reiki healing, will you choose the area, situation, or a reading, a mini reading. And you get to choose what you want your reading to be about, as long as it, my spirit team says I can read for what you asked me to, okay? How can I be more kind to myself and offer more grace in this very moment? Which is not very often they tell me that I can't, it's only like, very rarely. Okay, how can I be more kind to myself and offer more grace in this very moment is your soul truth message. Growing our self-love is medicine in the world's broken heart. When you heal, we all heal. When you give yourself more grace, you are able to give the world more grace. Today's soul action, look at yourself with a grace filter. You are meant to be in this moment of your life. Release the inner critic and fill in the hole with your soul's truth. That you are infinite, you are loved, and you are already there. And I do feel energy work, like Reiki and things. You can watch the videos I put out, watch other Reiki healers that you feel connected to, it will help, okay? I do it on the quantum level, so make sure that you're seeing, you're watching someone who knows how to do quantum healing. Uh, I mean, re regular Reiki works, quantum just gets down at the root of the issue, okay? That's why I say that. All right, I love you guys very much, and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Thanks for viewing, tuning in. And I love you all. Till we meet again.